This exercise is the oblique side bend with a kettlebell. Okay, so we're gonna use the kettlebell to kind of add resistance to our movement. Very much an isolation exercise for our obliques. Too often we train just that, that front on core um, and we always neglect those obliques. That's, that's, that's not what we want to do here as far as training. We want to train everything in concordance together so we don't have any discrepancies. We're not super strong in one direction and weak in another direction. We want to train the whole package. So, make sure you're training obliques. This is a great way to do it. Grab yourself a kettlebell. Coaching cues. Let that bell basically hang right, right on your hip. Off arm is to the side. You're grabbing your oblique very much. I, I love getting the, the kinesthetic feedback. So you can kind of feel that muscle already engaging just as you stand here and hold this bell. It's got to be turned on to fight the rotation this bell is trying to do. So we're here, grab those obliques, you'll feel it engaged. All you're doing now, letting this bell slowly slide down your hip. You're going to stretch this oblique out as it slides, slides, slides. Okay, and then to pull yourself back up, just use this oblique to contract, bring yourself back to neutral. Slide, 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 contract, bring it back to neutral. Keep repeating. So the coaching cues, make sure you don't have any forward or backward, no flexion or extension. You're just moving in the side plane. So if I look at it from down the line, I don't want to see any moving forward, and I definitely don't want to see any extension. All I want to do is see you bend to the side, pull back up to the side. So imagine you've got a plate of glass in front of you, a plate of glass behind you. You don't want to hit those things. You just want to move right between them. The only way you can do that is just successfully side bending. Okay, from this opposite angle, we're here, straight back up. Okay, so make sure there's no flexion extension, just side bending, only using those obliques to pull yourself back to neutral. Kettlebell loaded oblique side bend.